Hey everybody! This video is going to be a Goodwill haul video. Uh, had a little bit of extra money come back into our bank account from a refund on a car rental. So I uh, went ahead and did a little bit of shopping today and uh, sent off a couple packages and uh, yeah, so uh, here we go. First thing I picked up was this bucket for $1.99. It's empty. It's just a Connects bucket. It says it had 400 pieces in it, but uh, it the, the lid on it snaps closed, so this will be good for my boys' Legos. The next thing I found was this uh, Pampered Chef. Um, food chopper and it was $6.99 and I already actually have this but I loaned it to a friend and it came back with this piece missing she could not find it for nothing she scoured her kitchen to look high and low for it but she couldn't find it and I went and checked to see about getting a replacement piece and that seemed to be kind of a pain to do but uh, I'm really happy because mine is kind of old and yeah, I can uh, use a new one. So this is an awesome deal for seven bucks. I think they sell for like 20 something brand new. So and it even came with the little flyer thing with the recipes with it that they always put with their products. So I'm super excited about that. Anyway, so there's that. Next item I found is this. It's another perpetual calendar. So I think I might retire this one until Christmas time and uh, have this one out. Um, not necessarily keen on the whole teacher's thing because I'm not a teacher. Um, so I might alter this at some point, but until I do, it'll just sit here like this. And it was $3.99. So there's that. Then I found, and then I found this. It was... $2.99 and it is one of those a badge a minute all the parts are in there and I think it even has some of the plastic pieces to make it has instructions and it has this in here um, so I, I don't know if that's plastic pieces or if somebody's um, badge that they were going to make, but, um, replacement parts for badges and pins and stuff can be gotten, and I've been wanting to get one of these for a while, so there's that, and then there was this, this Dick and Jane note card, it says it's got 20 note cards and envelopes, but I counted them and there's actually 24, or was it 25? I don't know. 24 or 25 with these designs. Not that the designs matter, but I think I bought, I think I'm going to use these to make um, the mini envelope journals, mini journals. And uh, it was two bucks, which is a pretty good deal for a set of envelopes and note cards. Then I found this little bird cage. So I don't know if you all know, but Goodwill has this uh, um, this uh, membership that they have, where you get points for what you buy, and after you get 500 points, which it's a, it's a dollar per point. So basically, you have to spend 500 dollars, and they give you a 10 dollar um, credit slip. Well, I was, oh, and they're discontinuing that part 
um, where you have to spend that to get the $10. They're not giving out the $10 credits anymore, but you do get to keep your member card, and then if you purchase $25 or more, you get, I heard somebody say you're going to get 10% off. Right now, it's tw it's 5%, so I think they're bumping it to 10% to make up for um, taking away the $10 credit slip. But anyways, the reason why I bring that up is because I was really close to getting my 500 and they're discontinuing it af at the end of this month. You had until the end of this month to use up your points and use your $10 credit slip. Um, so to, as of today, I needed to spend $24 plus a dollar um, because my $24 put me at $500 and then I needed to spend another dollar to get the $10 slip. So I spent the $24 and change and then I bought this for a dollar and got my $10 slip and then used it on the rest of my purchase. But anyways, um, so I'm glad I was able to use it up and get that last uh, credit slip in before they discontinued it. Um, so I got this tiny bird cage, which is pretty cool. I've got a couple of tiny birds that I could use to um, put in this um, at some point. I'm not, I've not experienced a whole lot in altering objects, but I do want to eventually get into it. And I thought that was a really cute cage. And then I picked up this whiteboard. For 99 cents it's just a small one which is exactly what I've been wanting um, I'm gonna put a little sign on it for my boys I saw something posted on my Facebook that had um, board b-o-r-e-d written along the side and then it had um, acronym words I think acronym is the word I'm looking for um, with those the letters of board so that if one of my boys are bored they can look at this and then figure out what they can do about it so got that and then I picked up this Crayola watercolors washable watercolors and it has not been used at least it doesn't look like it's been used um, thinking ahead to my son going into second grade I'm going to set this aside for his school supplies. It's already got somebody's name written there, but that's okay. I can cross it off and put my son's name on there. And it was only 99 cents, which is a really good deal for those. Okay, and then I picked up this baster for 99 cents because there's been a couple of times where I've wanted to uh, baste like a roast or my turkey at Thanksgiving if I'm making one. Um... So yeah, got myself one of those. And then found these, uh, I think it's their plaster. Mm, I'm not sure. I don't know if it says so on here. It's only 99 cents. Let's see. Curious. Nope. Anyways, I think they're probably plaster. Anyways, I want to paint these, and maybe my son can give it to his teacher on Teacher Appreciation Day, maybe, if he wants to. And then I found this Elmer's Painter's Opaque Paint Marker, um, Metallic Misumi Silver, since the cap is silver. I don't know how this works. Let's see. Um, it says permanent streak free medium. It was at 99 cents. Hmm. It says uh, painters are filled with real acrylic paint. Practically any surface wood, paper, photos, plastic, and metal. Let's see. It says. When used on fabric, heat set before laundering. So yeah, I guess it can be used on just about anything. So that's pretty cool. See how that works. And then I picked up this uh, card file. It was 99 cents, but it's full of index cards. 
So 99 cents for this case and all those index cards is a pretty good deal. And I picked up a couple memory cards for $1.99 a piece from my boys PlayStation 2. I don't know if they're going to work. We will try that out. Might already be some safe games on there. And then I found a pair of pants for myself. And then I think the deal of the day is this. And it is what this is. And it was $6.99 for that. Um, it says it has, uh, it says clay machine handle and cover, C-clamp and instructions. Well, I think, hmm, I think the only thing missing from the instru is the instructions. Um, and it says this cover. There's no cover in it, and there's nothing like that in here either, but I don't think that says it's included. But anyways, I've been wanting something like this. I've got some clay, and I want to work with clay, see if I like it. So, yeah, I picked that up for eight, seven bucks, so that's a pretty good deal. And uh, lastly, I got, let knock over the camera again. Let's see, I picked up this uh, wallet for $1.99. It's super adorable. I hope my phone fits in it. So yeah, it's really cute. I love it. I hope it works. And uh, anyway, so that's it. That's my Goodwill haul. And uh, thanks for watching, and I will talk to y'all later. Bye-bye.